Welcome guys, it's Brian from Nerd Crew. So today I'm going to go over what you should bring to one of the theme parks. Since we live here in Orlando, my wife and I go to the parks a lot. So we're going to go over what we bring to maybe help you out. Okay, guys, so right now I'm going to go over a few things that you might want to bring with you to the park. Now, some of these you might want to leave out. It just all depends on how big your, your bag that you're bringing is because um, you want to kind of stay compact and kind of small because you got to lug this thing around all day. So first of all, you want to bring a good pair of sunglasses, okay, something that's going to stay on your head um, throughout rides and whatnot if they let you. Some of them don't let you. Uh, I have a, just a regular pair of Oakleys here, you know, the great sunglasses I've had in about six, seven years now. Um so this is the bag I bring. This is a <clears throat> this is a simple tactical back, uh, sling backpack I got off of Amazon. It was about twenty bucks, so it was a great deal for me. For one, I, I know this is uh, one of those things. This says you want to bring your cell phone, guys. Bring your cell phone with you. Take pictures. Be able to stay in contact with all your family members and so forth. So that's one thing you want to definitely bring with you. Uh, this thing's got a lot of pockets and great. You want to bring a little bottle of Tylenol or Excedrin or anything like that, just in case you know you you bang your head on the ride or you know you're just out all day long in the heat. You might want to bring a little some little Tylenol with you. Okay, another great thing to bring is a is an extra battery pack for your cell phones slash cameras or you know any other kind of electronic device you want to bring with you. Uh, you're gonna be there a lot of times. <clears throat> the park's open. I'd say 8, 9 o'clock sometimes during the summers, and you could be there until 9, 10 o'clock at night, so your phone's going to need a charge, so that's definitely something you really want to bring with you. Um, a Band-Aid, just in case, this is just something I always keep in my bag, it's just a simple Band-Aid, really to go on the heel of your, of your foot, just in case you get those blisters, good thing to have. So we're going to go down here to another one of my pockets, a lot of pockets in this thing. Spray sunscreen. This is probably the best thing to bring, I think, is the spray because it's very convenient. You can just spray it on and go. Uh, it's water. It's waterproof and everything else. It's a great one. This is a, I think this is an SPF 30. This is just a regular one we just carry around with us. But that's a great one to have. It's spray sunscreen. An extra pair of socks because water rides, you never know. Just an extra pair of socks in your bag to have is always great to have. Uh, let's, now we're going to go into the bigger pockets. Now these are, these next couple of items I carry with me when I go to Universal especially because of the water rides is just a pair of water shoes. You can change out your tennis shoes and your socks, get a pair of water shoes on, you can go on all the water rides and not have to slosh around the rest of the day with soggy tennis shoes, which is always great because no one wants to walk around all day in sloshy tennis shoes. An umbrella. This is just a small, regular one-person umbrella. Uh, it is South Florida, well, Central Florida. Every day it's going to. Every day during the summer, it pretty much rains in between four and six o'clock in the afternoon. You might want to have an umbrella handy just in case, or a poncho. Uh, really, your preference. Poncho is a little easier to carry if you have a smaller bag than this one. Poncho works too. Water bottle, guys. This this right here will save you a lot of money and keep you hydrated throughout the day. Universal, SeaWorld, and Busch Gardens will all fill your water bottle for free with ice. Disney Parks, they'll give you the cups and you gotta fill it yourself. Um, sometimes they give you ice, sometimes they don't. But definitely bring a water bottle with you so you're not stuck spending three, anywhere between $2.50 and $4 for a bottle of Dasani water. Definitely have a water bottle with you. Um, what else? A cooling towel. This thing is probably one of the best I think I've come across. This is a mission, just a mission cooling towel. We had these when we went to Bush Gardens last year in the middle of August. It was a hundred and I think 110 degrees. This thing right here was a lifesaver. It was the best thing I've come across in a while. It's not going to drop your body temperature by 30, 40 degrees, but it will keep you cool. You can put it over your head. It's great to have. Uh, 
I think that's about it, right? Yeah, that's about it. So, but that's a lot of stuff to carry in a little small backpack. And that's another thing you want to do. Also, carry pack light, guys. I understand this is a lot of stuff, but this all fit in this little backpack. Another thing you want to do, what I'm wearing right now is pretty much what I wear to the parks is an Under Armour shirt. You, or you don't have to be Under Armour, but be some kind of light material along with your along with your shorts and your tennis shoes. Shorts, I I'll, I never tell I never tell people to wear jeans. Wear shorts. Wear some kind of basketball short or some kind of mesh shorts because it's going to be hot. And you don't have to worry about carrying everything in your pockets because you have a bag. And at the parks, uh, Universal has lockers you can rent for free just with with a fingerprint. Uh, Disney, you don't really need them because every ride you can pretty much carry a bag on. SeaWorld and Busch Gardens, <clears throat> you can rent a locker. Uh, I think it's 10 bucks a day. Um, but, you know, it, it's not that bad. It's really not. So that's about it, guys. Uh, if you have any questions, comments, or anything, just leave them down in the, in the comments, and I'll try to answer anything else you got.